This video is for this guy, and some people they are using MediaTek chipset and lower. Okay, now listen me up. Before we jumped into the topic, do subscribe if you are new here, and share this videos with your friends. So yeah, in this videos I'll show you how to get maxed FPS, fix FPS drops, get stable FPS and much better performance in MediaTek chipset, by using Smart Kernel. So make sure watch into the ends of the videos. Like I've said before, this method should be useful for device with MediaTek chipset. Because MediaTek is not so optimized as Snapdragon and another chipset in low-end devices. Anyway, these optimizations can include tweaks to CPU scheduling, memory management, I.O. operations, and other low-level system functions. Smart Kernel can also help low-end devices run smoother by optimizing how the CPU and memory are used, reducing lags and stutters. All you need to do is install the Smart Kernel. Copy the script and enable some settings in the apps. I recommended you to watch in landscape mode to make it easy to learn. Anyway, I can guarantee this is 100% safe because Smart Kernel is not editing database inside the games. Alright guys, download the Smart Kernel and script I've used from link in the descriptions below. And now, let's focus into the tutorials.
Here we need to apply all the script with same method. Make sure you do this correctly to avoid any mistakes. If you are done, simply click on 6 dot icon right here. Now enable on boot options for all files. Alright, now click on 6 dot icon again and do execute. After that, go to settings of the smart kernel. Scroll down and enable script options. The final step is clear all recent apps. Restart or reboot your device to get the effect. And finally you can go log in into the game. Okay. Now if you want to delete, you can disable all the command script from Smart Kernel. After that, delete script files from File Manager and uninstall Smart Kernel. And the last, do restart or reboot to make your devices normal as before. Anyway, you can also combine with any config from me to get more stable performance. So make sure to check my playlist in the descriptions below. Alright guys, that's for today's videos. I hope this method will help you and thank you so much for your support and love. Because I always appreciate all of you. Don't forget to subscribe as you don't miss any upcoming useful videos for COD Mobile. So stay safe, and I'll see you on the next content.